Hey guys, this is Telus, and today we've got some Spell Knight gameplay and some thoughts about Lin's class design. Rin, Lin, I, I don't know, I don't, I'm not even trying to remember their names at this point. Um, I start out by saying I like Rin. I like what she represents. She's, to me, she represents, uh, hope. As corny as that sounds, she does represent hope. Um, she's an MP character, a solidly put together class. And I think she's a sign that maybe Cog has realized that AP and SP doesn't work. So I actually was lucky enough to get some good games, some good games with Lynn against uh, Starcore. And it's not not the best Lynn, Rin, Lynn, whatever. Um, but good enough to kind of demonstrate the capabilities of the class. I think that as a combo character, she she can succeed. I wish Cog had a second section to their class releases because I mean, almost every new class needs a rebalance almost immediately. I mean, it's not like their fault. I you know, I don't expect perfection the first try, but like Lin or Rin <laughs> is um a good class. But for example, there's some things that need to be changed. For example, uh. Her basic combo is her greatest source of damage right now, and it's way easy to hit with. And in my opinion, that basic combo it should be a means to an end, not the end itself. And that end should be her specials, which are, I mean, with the exception of the overpowered 2 bar, pretty crappy. They're just pretty awful. Um, the hitbox, nice miss there. Phono number one. Um, the hitbox on the 1 bar is... It's bizarre. It's almost it's too far out from the uh, the player, and it doesn't at all reward you for getting the combo, which is what I think should happen. I think that you should, you know, work with your glyphs and your basic combo to move your character into your enemy into a position where you can hit them with your one bar. And I think that one bar should be. I mean, this is where I would like to see a one bar like Geese's one bar. Maybe not quite as powerful, and probably with a little bit less range on top. But, like, you should be doing a large amount of damage. That's just the way it is. Because that's what your goal was. Your whole combo was leading up to using that one bar. And that's how I feel that it should work. Um, as it is now, like I said, the basic combo is the most powerful. And you can infinitely chain... She doesn't really do it in this video. But you can infinitely chain those tornadoes if you um, do the dodge... At the same second you release the last tornado, you'll basically move inside of the tornado and have enough time to start another combo. And that, I mean, that's an, that can lead to a ludicrous amount of damage. I played probably 30, closer to 40 1v1s against Nexus Striker. Okay, not not exclusively against the Striker, but against Nex. And, um, you know, that's kind of what happened. I would use those infinite combos and it would just be a kill. And, uh... You know, I mean, that was the combo, and I don't think that's the way it should work. I think I should be forced to use my glyphs as well as my basic combo in order to, it's my in order to um, create some damage. But I also think that the damage shouldn't be so low. Like the glyphs, I wouldn't mind seeing a damage increase in them. I don't think that the damage should be so low that you can't, you can't. Oh, sorry. Sometimes I, I usually hit F9 to start a match, and that's what happened there. Also, there's, it's also the hotkey for recording on preps, so that'll happen again later. Um, what was I saying? Oh yeah, um, and that's basically what happens. I think that the uh, the damage on the combo and the glyphs should be enough that continuing a combo should be a feasible way of dealing damage. It shouldn't be exclusively in your specials, because I think that's a mistake, especially for a combo character. Um, some other thoughts, some things I think that they did really well. I was very happy that uh, Lynn could not air grab. That would have been a disaster. She would have been horribly overpowered. Everything would have let you air grab. And uh, she's pretty much got a gimped grab in general. I mean, did you see the the grab? It's just it's messy. The animation's bizarre. It doesn't a lot lend itself to anything. It's actually longer than most regular grabs, which I actually like a lot because I think that discourages the grab spam. And I think that's very important for a class like this. I, that's one of the things I like the most about Lin is it encourages the correct style of play. You know, where PK, even though it had the enormous um, potential for 
different playstyles, which have actually emerged more so since they got nerfed. But it was in it encouraged because of the counter, the damage, and everything. It encouraged you to just spam the the dash, the JF dash, because it couldn't be countered easily. It did a huge amount of damage, and the range was great, and you were invisible while you did it. Um, but this one, you know, it encourages you. Grabbing's not going to work, even though it may be an easier thing to do in some situations. You're encouraged to do your to start combos instead because you're not. That's how you're going to get your damage. So I think that worked really well. Um, and yeah, like I said, thank goodness she cannot air grab. That would have been way too much. Um, there's a big problem that I just kind of left out because I think it's it's really obvious. Is the two bar the Haste range on the two bar is just ludicrous. That I mean, it covers the entire map. What reason could you have <laughs> for making it that way? Um, yeah, it's. I mean, haste is probably the most lethal effect that can ha happen in uh, in PvP. It's the most dangerous, especially in teams. But I mean, I can use that anywhere on the map and haste someone. I mean, when I was playing against Nex, I had to actively restrain myself from using that special because it completely ruined everything else. Like, I couldn't try any skills if he was already dead because I hasted him. And it makes for an extremely easy spawn kill. And because um, none of the uh, attacks that start our combos knock down, Lin can uh, can pretty much com start comboing you even if you're in the air, even if you're trying to escape. See, that, that, that one bar had no right to miss there. It should have it should have been a hit. It was a very nice thing. <laughs> That's right. That was an accident. I meant to use Cannon and Strike, but we won't tell her that or him that. Um, you know, the two bar is just it's messy, and the the hasting is just too much. I don't I don't understand how that came about. I would rather believe it's a bug than anything else. But um, you know, nothing you can do about that. That's just a major problem. It's not really, and in all honesty, it's not really worse than. Strikers ridiculously easy spawn kill, or things like that. So you can just kind of leave that, I guess. It needs to be changed, but it's not an emergency. Um, another thing I would like to see changed is the way the glyphs work with specials. Um, I think that if the one bar resembled geese is more, it, that I mean the way it works now is fine. I think that one version should be more damage, but with no glyphs. Which I think would work great. I think that would be the special you use at the end of your combo. That'll be your, your final thing. And, um, you know, that's fine. That's the end of your combo. That's your goal is to reach it, is to reach a point where you can use that special and guarantee your hit. Um, the other version is the, is like the one we have now, um, where the glyph shows up and it keeps your opponent in the air for a little bit. And that can be the kind of special that, like, that you would start a combo with. It's gonna do less damage, but it's going to, enable you to combo better because you're not always going to start with tornadoes sometimes you're gonna have to use a, a one bar it's just the way it is it's, it's kind of just kind of whatever works at the okay, time um, two bar glyphs I think the haste is a good idea the only problem I have with it is I would want I mean this is a dream this is kind of uh, I always say balance is a never-ending process it's kind of like that it's impossible to really do but um I would like to see, I mean, the haste is, it doesn't matter how long it lasts, it's going to be the best thing you can do in PvP. And I would like to see a way that, um, another great miss there. Uh, I would like to see it, uh, some, some way, some second version of the special that is as good or not, if not better than the haste. I would want them to be a time to use both types of the special, but I cannot see that happening right now. Why would I ever use, um the unglyph version versus the glyph version. And, I mean, if it doesn't work that way, it's fine. Someone really has to teach me how to spawn kill. Um, if it doesn't work that way, it's fine. It's just the way I would like to see it happen. Um, I think the way it goes now is the unglyph version lasts forever, but I don't think that should happen in PvP, especially something that is can be as dangerous as that. That's not right. It's like PK's one bar, nothing should be that long. Um, the three bar, I don't know, the three bar isn't very useful for PvP, just either version. Although, I think it's really cool for dungeons. I like having the options. You know, I'm, if I'm on part two, say I'm going to use the, the glyph version over the unglyphed, which I might use on Guy, because I thought that was really cool. Um, so, uh, 
yeah, I like her design overall. I think that some changes should be made, and really they don't involve changing anything but some numbers okay. and the first bar. But uh, yeah, I was I was pretty happy with it. I'm glad. I hope I look forward to her second job. I hope that I really wish they would balance more often because it just it's not something you can just do once and think it's done. Uh, just watch the game. You know? Number one. Yeah, that. I mean, the glyph version. Look at how long it lasted. And I really. Okay, okay. I do have a reason for doing those two bars. Okay. So if you think I just suck, it's not because of that. The two bar really messes the other person up when you use it. They one. They. They're uh, subconsciously afraid of going that direction now, like because they know they're gonna take damage. They may try, but it's gonna be a messy try, a messy attempt. It's so bad at spawn killing. It's going to be a messy attempt, and it throws the flow of the game off, and that's like a 1v1 thing. I think I talked about it on the forums once, but it's a hard thing to explain. I love my Z combo. Yeah, it's it's a nasty grab. There's just nothing you're gonna do with it. So I think that's great, though. I think that's the way it should be. It's my single favorite thing about SK, right there. I can torture anyone who misses their special because I can. I mean, usually if I were playing Knight or SM or something, I would drop down on them and combo them. Where, but SK, I can just run right over their head and use the dash attack. It's got a weird hitbox, so it hits the bottom. And just, it does the full damage. Which is even more than it does if I were to hit them head on while they were standing. It's kind of funny. Okay, Analyze. let's begin. Neutralizing. I still haven't decided how I feel about Gunslinger. And the damage buff that it got. I think I'm okay with it. It's hard to explain. It's hard to decide, really, not explain. Decide, because it does do a lot of damage, but... Gunslinger is a defensive class, and a defensive class needs to have... It needs to have more than just the ability to knock their opponent down a lot, I think. It needs to have a, de a full deterrent, and a deterrent would, is something that's... You know, I mean, it's I want it wants... Wow, I'm having a hard time talking. I just woke up. I want them to uh, feel actually scared of going to attack because there's consequences. So I want them to take an opponent to take their time if I'm playing a defensive class. And I think that Gunslinger's bullets do that. You can't fire more than five at once, and I think that's fine. And you know, I mean, ugh, that was a pretty, that was a pretty play. I mean, I was very happy with that. Um, you know, this person's pretty good. I like that she didn't, she doesn't run the kind of funnel pattern that most gun, good gun singers do. You know, where they kind of um, go to the sides, drop down to the middle, and then jetpack back to the top and do a kick or something, and then go to the sides, drop back down to the middle. Like, that's kind of the... I mean, it's Elven, so... That's almost the strategy for anyone with movement. But... It was still nice to see it. See it less relied on. I was happy to fight the Gunslinger, though, because... It's more interesting than fighting another striker or something. And it's not like it can't be competitive. I, I mean, I've never been really a Mary player, but... If I were, I think I'd be a gunslinger player. Yeah, no spawn kill there. See, that was my chance to do a... Uh, what, what did I call that again? I called it like a reverse wall auto or something. Or not auto. Reverse wall lock or something like that. Something long and impressive sounding. That was very nice by her. Or him. See, that's why I like Gunslinger. The ability to change your height like that, that's great. And I guess like a... Against like a striker or something, where momentum is everything. You can just slip right over him and hit him and... It works great. Yep. Ugh. 
I think I could have won if I played a few more games. Gunslinger's got a pretty heavy advantage on Elvin over anything but pretty much Amy or Liar or Army. Okay, pretty heavy advantage against most melee classes. So, I mean, it wouldn't be easy to dislodge him. But uh, that's all I've got. It's 15 minutes. I just woke up, so I'm pretty happy with myself. I did something useful today. Um, let me know what you thought about the video. Um, again, about play about my playing, about my ranting, about Lynn. Do you agree? Disagree? Did you like the format? And uh, really, anything else you can think of?